guys. It's um, Snowman Gaming. Welcome to Kid Clown. Look at that animation. That's pretty nice. I've never heard of Kemco, have you? Yeah. Oh. That's really cool that the graphics are pretty nice. What the hell? This is like kind of a this is an interesting style. What is up with these hidden gems? But is this like a yeah, this is really weird. What is this for? Super Nintendo? This is Super Nintendo, yeah. Like how come we didn't hear about this game? Was this Kid Clown? It's called Kid Clown? Kid Clown? Hmm. Let's come to the title screen. I guess we'll I guess we'll see it. Yeah, the style looks like a <laughs> mid or late nineties kind of art style. Listen up, sweet cakes. Your dad, King Clown. Ah, wait, we're evil. Maybe that's the actual Maybe evil that's guy. the villain, yeah. This is showing us the villain. Yeah, I think King Clown was the character that tumbled across the screen oh. in the very beginning. Oh, yeah, you're so right. maybe this is the villain. Every Everyone in the game is a clown. Wow, look at these deets. Look at the details yeah, on the these The artwork's very good. Please, Kid Clown. <laughs> Save my daughter. Instead of doing it myself, I'm going to send a child on the <laughs> on the quest to save my daughter. Klutzy enough for this mission. You're the only clown wow. klutzy enough for this mission. Don't let it down. Hmm. I'll take that as a compliment. That's probably what you should say, because that's not a compliment. Kid Clown and Crazy Chase. Loving that logo. I'm loving it. Why haven't we seen this game before? I this is, this now this feels like an old timey old timey UI kind of the uh, that, that stage start screen there look at this it's uh it's like three quarters view almost oh bomb what the whole game the whole game is this look at the look at the perspective wait what oh my god it's like isometric it's like super mario rpg does it does it control like on diagonals it do you have to, or do you have to press like? Is it is it is it the awkward kind where the D-pad like turns sideways? Like if I, you have to control through the dial. Oh my god, I'm getting crushed. Or does it control like Super Mario RPG and good? Um, I I can't even take a second to figure it out because I keep getting crushed. Hmm. So good graphics. So gameplay um, maybe not. Oh my god. Um. So like le left go actually goes left, right actually goes right. Well, sort of. This is left, that's right, left, right, down. So holding down just makes you go faster on this plane. Oh, I see. And holding up stops that's you. That's kind of weird. Yeah, it is a little bit weird. But there's like a bomb. There's like a bomb fuse going on here, too. Yeah. So maybe if that bomb beats you in the race, you lose. I think that's the timer, I imagine. Wow, he's so klutzy. What? Well, they said they wanted the klutziest clown, right? So everything kind of slows you down, it seems like, in this game. That seems like it's more of a time-based game than in hit points based oh game God. but you do have a hit point gauge that at the top there yeah but you get stun locked every every yeah. three seconds this, maybe this game should be called stun lock the game you just got blown over to the side as if you weren't getting stun locked enough yeah the, wind, the wind's even an enemy oh in this God. game there, there's so many animations where you just can't do anything this this is much less fun than i thought it was going to be <laughs> yeah, the graphics made me think it was going to be really high quality i wonder what the deal is with this game oh my god i can't even jump over these pits <laughs> he, he got scared when he saw the axe. Where did these axes come from? Donkey Kong. Oh look, all four of the face buttons do the same thing. Jump. It's like Sonic the the TH. The TH. The the hedgehog. Wow. Sonic the henchman. This is really as disappointing as uh, as it looks. It's disappointing as I am to my family. There's a ninja game that I'm not sure if I've played before. It's called Super Ninja Boy. Oh, Culture, Culture Brain. Brain. This is by the fellas that made Kung Fu Heroes. Uh, Wait, no, we did. We made an episode about this game. Remember, it was called Game Soup Play Super Ninja Boy. That went out, didn't it? That's that's on this channel right now. Yeah. <laughs> so it turns out that we actually haven't played this game before. The one we played before was called Little Ninja Brothers, and this is Super Ninja Boy. But it's by the same company that made Kung Fu Heroes and Little Ninja Brothers. And Little Ninja Boy, no, Little Ninja Brothers was first NES, and this is a Super Nintendo game. So we definitely haven't played this before, and it's some kind of an RPG, and we haven't seen a random battle yet. So maybe there aren't any random battles. That was just a cave that led you through to the other side. Yeah. I'm looking for monsters here. I'm trying yeah. to get into a fight, but there's nothing. It's the same characters. It's got a little bit better graphics. Maybe the maybe the combat's no, not the combat system. Maybe the item system is a little bit less esoteric than the other games. We'll see, but the graphics obviously look better. Oh, here we go. Wow, the encounter rate must be really low. The group of enemies have appeared. So it's not even like an action battle. This is really more a RPG 
style. Bout. Bout. This is like Earthbound style or Dragon Quest. <gasps> oh, okay. So it is it is action. Wait, this is running at 60 FPS. Look how slow it is. Yeah. What's yeah, up I was with just going to say, did the frame rate just drop? Oh, it's great. It's great. Look at their faces. <laughs> it's one of these it's Japanese games again. God. There's like this whole series of games by this developer that are awesome and I didn't know anything about. I'm trying to get this. Where is it? I can't tell what plane that's in. 14 yeah. X points and 28 Sen. Sen is money. Sen is money. It rhymes with yen. That's why? Yeah. Oh, look at the encounter rate. Now it's huge. Yeah, maybe maybe there just wasn't an encounter rate before. Oh no. Maybe yeah, encounter yeah. rate. Maybe there wasn't an there wasn't uh, encounters possible in the previous area or yeah. in that cave for some reason. Yeah, oh, this, look. These must be power-ups. Yeah, it runs really slow. I wonder if this is the actual frame rate of the game. I don't know, man. This looks really awkward. Yeah, I guess you're right. It's, I think it's the, it's same. the same. I think it's just very slow. This is weird. It's like baby a kid's slow. Yeah, the combat's really slow in this. I kind of remember the other games being better. Well, I know Kung Fu Heroes was faster paced than this, because I've played dozens of hours of Kung Fu Heroes in my life. Well, this is great. I bet this is a good... Okay, that encounter rate. It's really high. <laughs> I bet this game is awesome once you get into it. So now you're fighting a Tiger Man. <laughs> oh. Oh, no! Kill him. Oh my god, run away. <laughs> oh, run away! I do like this style of game where the battles are... The battles are action instead hey. of instead of just like instead straight of like yeah RPG. like a turn based yeah like an uh, an active time bar type of like a Final Fantasy type of game or a you know a standard hey old school JRPGs. Did you notice that these tigers have drums for bodies? Yeah, and they're beating on their own bodies <laughs> to make noise. And it's to the rhythm of the music. No, it's not. And listen, when you punch them, listen to the sound. Awesome. It's the sound of a drum. I, I gotta give him points for creativity at least. Cool. Alright, this only counts because I haven't played the game before. Yeah, but I'm the one playing and I've played it before many times. It's okay, because it's okay. Shush. It's called Final Fight 3. What's up with that logo? Oh, this is a funny story actually. After the Mad Gear Gang was destroyed, the citizens of Metro City finally thought their nightmare would work. Is the next line gonna be, they were wrong? But without the Mad Gear to control the underworld, the street gangs fought amongst themselves for power of the city. Wow. In the end, the Skullcross gang reigns supreme. There's always problems in this metro city. Several months later, Mayor Mike Hagar got a call from an old friend. You know that guy, Mike, Mike Hagar? Mike Hagar beat up a bunch of mobsters, and he became the mayor. Cody beat up a bunch of mobsters with Hagar, and he went to jail. <laughs> <laughs> you know what he went to jail for? Beating up a bunch of bad guys. <laughs> okay, so... Uh, Hagar got off. Long time no see guy. guy. Guy Guy and Hagar went on hiatus during the second Final Fight game. Pretty well, I think I learned a few new moves. Okay, cool. Now watch what happens. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> what a coincidence. Wow. Detective Lucia, is she also a fighter? Yeah. She's the new character in this game. She uh, fights using only kicks. It's kind of awkward. Oh, only kicks. That's not kind of awkward. Alright. But do you know who we're gonna play as? Uh Guy. Yes. Any game where you can play as Guy, I always play as Guy. Why is Guy so great? Tell me. He's one of my favorite characters. He's one of the coolest characters. He's a ninja and he wears sneakers and he has really cool moves. So anybody that wears sneakers is cool, right? Well, if he's a ninja and he wears sneakers. Oh. He's a, he has the one-two punch. You know, I just finished watching Daredevil Season 2. And if you're, if you're planning on watching it and you don't want, like, the mildest of spoilers, mute the video. But otherwise, I'm going to talk about it. There's ninjas in it. It takes place in modern day New York, and there's actual ninjas that dress up in traditional ninja clothing and use shurikens and katanas. Shuriken. 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 Katan. You're really shuriken me out here. <laughs> that wasn't funny. Okay, continue. But the show strives for realism, at least at th until this point when the ninjas show up. It's really out of place. However, it's still an amazing season, and you should definitely watch it. And that I hope that wasn't a spoiler to you. If it was, send a postcard to Game Soup Games. Two. That's our address, two. And we'll write back to you with an apology, okay? So Hagar is the mayor 
of this city called Metro City. And uh, he's about to go beat up all of his cool citizens. Well, no, we're See playing as Guy. Yeah, he's we're playing as Guy, but that was the story. Ah. Uh. Okay, let's see if these controls are set up. Cool. You're yeah, uh, Ryu. Good. No, he's Guy. No, you're Ryu. He's much cooler than Ryu. He looks exactly the same. Except lankier. He looks lanky. Yeah, he does look a little lanky in this sprite. He looks more uh, more tough in Street Fighter Alpha. Oh. Uh. And in the in Street Fighter 4. Wait, he's in Street Fighter? Yeah. He's not a he's not a Street Fighter character though, right? He was originally in Final Fight, but then he was in Street Fighter after. Just like Cody was also in Street Fighter. Who's Cody? Uh, Street Fighter Alpha. Cody's the other main character from Final Fight. Uh, the first Final Fight. Oh, he's not in this game. Uh no, Cody is not in this game actually. He is in jail during the <laughs> timeline. <laughs> this just game, like actually. just like Guy was? Yeah. Except he wasn't rescued. All right. I haven't played this in so long. Two knee kicks and a body slam. Yep, it works every time. Works every time. That was originally for Street to Rage, though, right? Oh my God! Punch him in the groin. Yeah, kill him in the dick. As <laughs> they say. Oh, uh, Happy Hobbit. Uh, That's your favorite Twitch channel. Right? Nobody's ever gonna get that reference. Yeah. yeah. There's a there's a Dark Souls Twitch channel. He actually has the world record for uh, he's beaten Dark Souls without taking a hit. Yeah. His name is the Happy Hobbit. He's a Twitch.tv member. So after you finish watching this episode, if you've watched every other episode of GameScoop, go ahead and check out the Happy Hobbit on Twitch. Yep. This episode is brought to you by the Happy Hobbit. He's been paying us lots of money, more than Hudson Soft. So we've uh, gotten rid of Hudson Soft and fuck Hudson Soft and don't not fuck the Happy Hobbit because we really like him. Now. He's great. He's the best man. <laughs> he's a cool man. He's a cool man. We like him. He's on every night, actually, and I watch him almost every night. He's pretty funny. He's, he's an entertaining personality. Hey, get the fuck out of here, sir. Oh, oh yeah, that's right. Oh. Pretty Pushing awesome. Into, into something. Oh, yeah, that was a happy, happy Hobbit, one of his... Uh, one of his phrases is kill him in the dick. Every, oh, every time he fights this one boss, he says kill him in the dick. It's so funny. I don't understand these these channels where they play like one single player game over and over again. Where they get just really, really good at one single player game that's a game that most people only ever spend, you know, 20, like whatever, 10 to 40 hours playing. Yeah. With Dark Souls, maybe longer than 10 hours, but. I get it. I mean, most games, okay, in my experience, most games aren't as compelling as Dark Souls. Dark Souls has a lot of replayability. Essentially, infinite replayability. Yeah. For, I don't know, for people who like that kind of game. So that's partially, I think, why it's so pop. It's still popular. It's been out for. Yeah, it's I don't just know, one of the years. most perfectly designed games of all time. It, yeah, I think it just. It really is. Play. I guess. I guess I do understand, but it's I, it's not something I would ever do. Yeah. Well, I mean, you think about speedrunners. They spend even more time than certain Twitch, you know, Twitch streamers do playing only one game ever. Yeah. I don't know. I guess I play Hearthstone, so I guess that's something. But. Yeah. That's um, that's an ever-changing game, and there's kind of infinite strategy and skill involved in it. You can never really fully master the game. And once new cards come out, then it changes everything, and you have to relearn the game. And buy all those new packs. You know, I've been getting a lot of spectate quests recently. Really? And I got okay, so I got total dominance I, last I week. I wish I was getting spec spec quests. Really? I would well, I wouldn't do anything to not have them anymore. I don't want them. Oh, but you get a free pack. Yeah, good, but they're good. They're like kind of. I don't know. They're always crap. I have most of the classic cards, and I don't know. It's always, always, always duplicates. But so my last total dominance was a week ago. Before that, I hadn't had a total dominance in at least two months, and I reroll almost every day. But I've gotten the spec quests almost every week without fail. So I think, I think, I don't think it's random chance at all. I don't think it's RNG. I think Blizzard's out to get me. They don't want me to have my gold. They just want to give me packs. Yeah, you want packs of the new set when, yeah. when it comes out, so you want the gold. I don't care about classic packs, you know? I mean, I do care a little bit, because... Oh, I'm going to punch this guy in the, in do the stomach. I don't know how to dodge that. I don't really remember. Oh. Still missing a lot Come of here, cards Dave. from the base set. Oh, take that, take that in the abs. In the chest. And the deke. <laughs> what? The deke. What was that word you just said? The deke. Uh, okay, I've never heard that word before. <laughs> Oh god. He's so buff. I thought you were buff until I saw him. I thought you said he was skinny. In the beginning when we started playing. You know, I'm trying well, to but look at, out here. But look at his muscles, you know? He's like he's got buff muscles. He is lanky, but he's got buff muscles. But this guy this guy's a giant. 
Oh, I had not enough life to do my emergency attack. He has a lot of life, too. Huh. Sweet. What a cool dude! Well, I love Final Fight. It's one of my more favorite brawlers from this era. Partly because you can play as Guy, but also it's it's very it's well designed and they did a really good job with it. Final Fight 2, probably the probably the weakest one in the series, but one and three are pretty awesome. And it's kind of the opposite with the Streets of Rage series. The first and third Streets of Rage game are worse, and the second one is the classic. It's considered the best one, and I consider it to be the best one. His neck really it shouldn't be turning that <laughs> that far. <laughs> But oh, overall, God. the graphics in this are pretty awesome. It's yeah. old Capcom style, I love it. He needs a hospital. My name is Dean. Dean's one of the more douche, douchebag characters. I don't, I don't remember if they ever brought him back. He might have been in like the background of a Street Fighter game or some fighting game or something. Do you want to play a different game? Or do you want to stick with this one? Those maniacs killed my family! I want to scavenge them. No, let's just, uh, I don't know, we can play this for a little bit longer. Scavenge. This is just a filler episode. Did we mention this was a filler episode yet? I think we did. Cool. This is the tail end of one, right? This is not the start of one. Yeah, this is the tail end. It, you and I, man, t today has been, okay, you ever have one of those days, viewer, if you're watching and listening, you ever have a day where you just can't get your brain in order? You really yeah. just can't organize your thoughts. I don't have an excuse. You have a very good excuse. Yeah, I haven't been getting too much sleep the last couple of days. I've been pretty busy with work, but I'm gonna sleep tonight. But we wanted to get these. Uh, we wanted to get some episodes recorded because we ran out of episodes, and we're recording some filler episodes so that we never run out of episodes. Again. We're, we're constantly degrading ourselves. I wish. I wish we had never mentioned that these are filler. Because, well, I mean, they're not really filler. It's really just more of what we already been doing. Yeah, we're just, just thinking of them as filler. They're just shorter. Yeah, they're yeah. just shorter. And I mean, our shorter is sometimes longer than other people's videos anyway. Other people who do similar types of, of, of videos have videos that are like half the length of this, or, you know, like 10 minutes or less. So it's not really filler. Yeah, or most of our, st our stuff is mostly on raw and uncut. Raw. Yeah. Uncut. Ours is just, cool. yeah, unedited and un, like off the cuff, which is, I know you like that. You like off the cuff, I do too. But yeah, it's not really filler to me. But let's call it filler because it's funnier that way. What do we call them? Bonus? Bonus episodes? Bonus bonus? Like bonus double, bonus. Yeah, double, double bonus. bonus episodes. Double bonus filler. Foot one dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Why is that guy green? Did you see it? Go green. Vape Nation. Have you seen the Vape Nation video? Uh, it's sweeping. It's H3H3. You know that guy. The funny guy. The funny guy. Ethan. It's, I, I'm guessing, his most popular video ever. <laughs> Did you see that? I just turned him around. Yeah. I like these guys have just very generic names. Like Johnny. Oh, this, this is my friend Rick. Uh, Billy? Hey, Dirk. I guess this gets kind of repetitive to watch, huh? Yeah, I think brawlers always get kind of repetitive to watch. Let's close it out with... Uh, Comments of the week. No, we already did that. And plus, this is going to be aired. Aired. This is going to be posted in a while. Oh yeah, we actually can't do anything topical. If on this we show. do anything that's like topical, we're going to sound like it's old news. Oh no, I already mentioned. Now. What did we mention? I've, I've met uh, Vape Nation for one thing. Yeah. Actually, nah. Oh. Who cares? Oh darn. It'll still be up. If you're watching this, let us know what what day what day and time you're watching this. Give us the date and the year, because it might be a different year. Leave it in the comments below. God, some people will do anything to get a comment. Comment, like, and subscribe, you know? Yeah, we. I, I don't like saying to like and subscribe. I think it's kind of... I think boring. it's kind of... It's given, for, for one thing. And if you say it, you sound like a jerk. You, like, have, have enough faith in your viewers that, that they're competent enough to do that, you know? Like, I say it at the end of long forms. I say we don't mind... Uh, a thumbs up or 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 a subscribe. Oh yeah, we do say it. <laughs> yeah, but I don't say it at the end of every video. And yeah. I don't plug it. I say it once because long forms are kind of long. You might forget at the end of a half an hour. You might be like, oh, I'll sub to this guy after this video is over. And you might forget. I don't know. 
I don't know. I feel like there, there's a way to go about it where it's not obnoxious. Or at least slightly less obnoxious. Maybe I'm wrong. Chicken. <laughs> chicken. Oh, this, this guy's really pissed. This fat guy, he's really oh. pissed I ate his chicken. He's like, I was, I was saving that chicken in that barrel for later. Was no, his he's name? Really, really pissed. Oh, I thought his name was Fat Jerk. <laughs> Maybe. It's it's fat Jack. Find out what his name is, though. Fat Jack. Fat Jack. So tell us what you what you guys think about fat people in the comments below. Oh my god, man. <laughs> about about well, about Fat Jack specifically. Yeah, Fat Jack. He's okay. also wearing a pink shirt. Pink muscle shirt. Oh, oh Joe. Oh Joe, I'm getting sleepy. Yeah, me too. I'm gonna just uh, I, I, can't, I forget who the boss of this level is. Is it that guy? No, I don't think so. I think that's Call Man. Call Man. <laughs> Yeah, look, it's Call Man. He's uh, he's the next Mega Man boss. You never heard of Call Man? Mega Man Eleven. Oh, punch him in the gut a little bit. Call Man. Give him a good, give him a good fireballing. His name really is Call Man, though. Why? Are you sure he's not the boss? He looks like a boss. Uh, he's not the boss. He's too weak. Wow, that lady just wrecked you. Yeah, will not be wrecked by a lady named May. <laughs> Come here, Call Man. Call Man. Did you see that throw? He just kicked me in the butt. Yeah. What a fool and a jerk. Who are you? He's a fat jerk. Just call me Call Man. <laughs> call Man. That's such a rude throw. Oh, that's such course, a bad sir. name. He's even more buff than the last guy we fought. Fat Jack. So I think with any luck, nobody will ever see this episode air. Possibly. If yeah, it uh, takes a lot of pressure, over there. yeah. I don't, to, I don't even have to be good at Final Fight Three anymore. If all goes well, cool. you, you as the viewer, will never see this, and we'll uh, we'll set it and forget it. We'll upload it and forget that it ever existed. Because goodbye, we, Call Man. Goodbye, Call Man. Call Man. Time for you to hang up. <laughs>